My name is Brooke Seibel. I was born and raised outside of Bismarck, North Dakota, and I work with the Department of Transportation. What is your job title? Civil Engineer Technician 2. And tell us about your education path. I went to Bismarck State. Um, I had gone there for three years. I was taking general courses, wasn't sure which way to go, what to do with myself. And then I had decided on the Civil Engineer Tech program and went for another two years and completed with a degree there. So what do you do in your job? A lot of variety in my job. That's what I like about it best. Uh, during the summer, I'm on uh, highway... Oh, I'm stuttering now. <laughs> <laughs> during the summer, I do construction inspection. And during the winter, I am now with the surveys and photogrammetry department doing preliminary surveys. How many hours do you normally work? 40 to 50. And in the summer, does that change? Oh, that can get up to 70 hours. Describe a typical work week. Uh, this week, um, for example, we'll be hitting the road pretty soon, and we're going to be staying out of town, and we'll be working around Stanley and Bow Bells, uh, locating utilities and culverts uh, so that we can get some information into the designers so that they can decide which way to go with a future highway system. Do you take work home with you? Sometimes. If there's an area I want to learn a little more about, I'll usually do some reading at home on that. How would you describe the tree set which you work? It's good. It's not too fast, not too slow. Um, it's definitely busy. Uh, keeps mind and body going. What were your favorite classes in college? I liked materials and testing the best. How has your education prepared you for your career? It was very general. Um, we had everything from surveying to statics uh, to materials testing. So it was a very broad education, which worked well for this position. It's, it's always changing, always in a different location. Have you worked in other jobs like this? No, I haven't. Do you know what the starting wage for a job like this would be? Right around 2000 a month salary. Why did you choose this career? I had done some job shadowing um, with some other civil engineers and some ge geotechnical engineers, and just following them through their day, I could see myself in that position and that it was something that I would enjoy doing. What goals do you have in your career? Right now, to just learn as much as I can and do as best as I can, and right in about five years, I'll reevaluate and see where I want to go from there. What do you think it takes to be successful in this career? The desire to want to. The desire to move forward. Would you rather work with information or with people? With people. Do you travel for your job? Yes. Do you travel in state or out of state? In is state. It, is it just for work or do you go to conferences? Just for work. What are the most difficult de most difficult decisions to make? Those where there isn't a right or wrong answer, one you wouldn't find in a book, where it's got to be a judgment call. Do you work independently or on a team? On a team. If you do work on a team, give us some examples. Well, right now, the biggest one would be with working with the survey crew. Since we're out on the highway, it's great to have somebody there with you to watch your back for safety. And also, um, just sharing the information with each other. It's just helpful having two heads working on something. And if you had to give any advice to somebody who's interested in being a civil engineer tech? If that's what you want to do, give it your best shot because it's going to leave you wide open for a lot of job possibilities.